I've been having terrible nightmares about a giant sinkhole opening up underneath Tremont. Can you imagine anything more terrifying? One minute I'm there at the window collecting money, the next minute I'm plunging hundreds of feet to my death. Let me tell you something. All your drama is giving me a headache, bro. You know, we've all noticed lately that you've been kind of uh, intense. A lot of people think I have a very calming effect on others. So if you want to open up or share any of your feelings with me, I'm here for you. Oh man, my problems are my problems, all right? But if I could just give you one piece of advice. Oh God, bro. When you start to feel that rage rising up from inside of you, just chill out. Chill out. Hey man, listen, if you're gonna start acting like a therapist, I suggest you stay ass in the office. You want me to take you back? Hey, wait, can you pull in right here? For what? I just gotta pick up a couple things real quick. Just take a minute. Bro, we're on our way to a repo, bro. Come on, I gotta grab something. I'll just be a second. Wow. Bro, hurry up, man. I'll be one minute. talking about all these sinkholes and nonsense. Now, Bernice ain't no customer service type chick, but you know I'm a hook baby girl up. If you don't have a registration, you can't get your car point blank. That's it. I'm just gonna wait right here until you decide to give me my car. Really? Yeah, I really? I don't got no patience for this type of foolishness. That's wait. company policy. It's my car! It's registered for me! He bought the car for me! Get your manager, baby, because I don't want to talk to you! All right, well, talk to yourself, no, 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 dumbass, bro. No, no, no. A friend of mine was gonna open up an auto dealership here, but his financing fell through. If you really like the place, you gotta let me know so we can jump on it. You know what I mean? There's a lot of people looking at this property. I've only got three days to find Tream on a new place before we get evicted, and I'm freaking out. So no brainer, Christy. I do have an appointment to check out one more place. The last thing I need is to owe Perez any favors, but right now, it may be my only choice. Listen, no pressure here. What do we have, like 72 hours? I gotta run. I left Bernice in charge of the dispatch, and I gotta say, I'm kind of worried. You want 250 dollars for me to get my car back, which shouldn't have been taken in the first place. 250. You're, you're just nothing but a bitch. You, you're a bitch. That's what you are. Man, why? Everybody gotta try Bernice. You wanna see a bitch? Yeah, that's right. You come I'm out here and you bring me my car. You see a bitch here? I slept fine, your old ass. I don't know how Christy does it. I haven't released a single car all damn morning.